Hello, mate. Are you right? you I got on. the camera rolling. <laughs> this is Andy from Fox How and Sons. Remember what we did? Yes. That I turned up and said I need to show this video to yeah, Yana, yeah, yeah. my partner. I remember. <laughs> two years ago, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Hello. Right. Are you all right I, with this? I've yeah. Aged, I've aged a bit since. <laughs> oh no, you haven't at all. No, you haven't at all. Hey, you keep them crikey. Well, yeah. Looks, They're the eighteen ninety tiles we found under there. Yeah, looks a little different, doesn't it? Yeah. Come on then. Crikey. So, are you alright with me video? Have yeah, we got before yeah. and after videos and see what you, yeah. you know, your, see what your reaction is? Yeah, thank you. So we haven't, we've got, there's still stuff to do. Yeah. Because it all needs a coat of paint. We just oh, had yeah, it sprayed. Yeah, right, yeah. That is going to be new. There's going to be a new front door. That's still the yeah. old front door. So that's why it doesn't, it doesn't look much different from the front, apart from the cladding we took off yeah. and re-pointed everything and did all that. Yeah, yeah. Which is, you which can is see. always a good start. That's true. <laughs> That's so, true. Yeah, bloody hell, yeah, it looks completely different, doesn't it? Yeah. Crikey. I like the bare brick. Do you? Yeah, yeah. It's alright, isn't it? Stay, it's going to stay like that. Yeah, yeah, because yeah. there's no back entrance. So, like, we just thought, why don't we have the, the shed at the front? Yeah. You know? Because yeah. we all cycled, so, like... I know, was, yeah, yeah. Cycling like <laughs> right. Cycling, yeah. I was going to try and move those, but... And then this was, this was the doorway <laughs> into the... Drug that was the doorway <laughs> into the living room. Yeah, that's the kitchen's at the front. Oh, Kitchen at the front. Like that. Crikey. Yeah, it looks, looks like a completely different house to be there, doesn't it? <laughs> so light. It was dark before, wasn't it? Where yeah, it was yeah. Like, it was all insulated from the walls and stuff and all sorts hanging from the ceiling, wasn't there? That's the Can't original. That, in, which is that's nice. the only original bit left, is yeah. that coving round the top. I like the coving, to be fair. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I definitely would have kept it in. You didn't really realise how high the sea levels were before. <laughs> but no, now, I know. Now it's like this. Crikey, so you've knocked all these walls out. Well, we there wasn't really much of a wall left in that bit, was there? <laughs> well, there, no, that it was, was like that was the, um, the lean-to was there. Yeah. Which is... And the pond was like where the stove is. <laughs> yeah. And then that was, this was the dining room. There was a door there. Yeah, yeah. And then that was the corridor down to the yeah. kitchen there. Yeah. yeah. And there was a wall there. That was the big supporting wall there. Yeah. How have you got all that without? I guess you just, I was going to say there's no like strength of them beams, but you've lowered the ceiling. There's a massive so straight, portal frame in there. All oh, right. And, and a massive cage under there, which holds everything up. Right. And And this, there's a steel, the there's a steel in there. There's a steel steel in there there's a steel that way yeah so it's yeah, yeah. i've got I, i'll send you the 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 website um because i've done a website for it and i, I documented everything like assiduously yeah. yeah like images and all kinds of stuff yeah we kind of built it using a facebook group all right. a secret facebook group where we had uh, my mate who's the architect yeah and the builders and the draftsmen we, uh, uh, and me and yeah we were all in a facebook group sharing stuff and okay. having little conversations so we didn't yeah, have to ideas. have so many meetings and things like that fair enough that sounds good yeah, yeah. The window and that brings a bit extra light as well doesn't it yeah well, that, that was that was sean's idea yeah yeah it's a good idea definitely the more light you can get the better isn't it yeah. Obviously, when you extend out on something, you can all, you know, there's always that worry of making Well, you know, we haven't out, extended it? out because, no, square off. like that, that's yeah. the side return there, yeah. and this was the, this was the, the actual, we, we actually took stuff down because the toilet, the outside toilet used to be there, or the toilet yeah. in the thing. So we, we oh, took, we took yeah. the wall down here, put another skin up to create a cavity because that was the internal wall and pulled this down yeah. and then you know my average coming and paint and put a new kitchen <laughs> <laughs> I remember that's the wood burner is it that's the wood burner yeah, yeah. yeah well it's not working still not working yet the guys who installed it made a hash of it uh, yeah and it, it connects to a thermal store upstairs you can see the pipes there so it, yeah, he yeah. it heats water as well as space oh, okay nice have you been out did you go around the back no. Oh, right. No, no, come on, come out here. Yeah, it's 
And they, they slide all the way, so they're like completely... I haven't seen many like that, where you can get such a big space for them. There's always, you know, yeah. like a, uh, a uh, pillar in there. Yeah, incredible. <laughs> That's pretty good, isn't it? Took me ages to find them. Yeah, I bet. Yeah, you don't see them very often. No. Because you usually have people bifolds, don't they? Yeah. But it means you can have partial glazing in the winter or the spring or the autumn so you can let air in and stuff. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's great. I've never seen any done like that. Yeah? Yeah, yeah I'll look. It's literally completely different. Well, if you haven't been round there and looked up, then. Uh... Can you change the. Um... Into the front as well, so I don't want to go up there. Oh, bloody hell. <laughs> Jesus. What is that? Is it a solar panel? Yeah. Is it? Yeah. Bloody hell. And here, look, no, there's. Crikey. All the way along. It's on that side, that side, and that west wall, and on the roof. So the house. Well, it's self. For the last month, we've been self powered. Is it? Yeah. 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 It heats the hot water, does everything. Because the house is primarily kind of electric. Yeah. Um, and the stove is there for the winter for space heating and water heating when yeah. there's no sunlight yeah, and yeah. there's not sufficient sunlight to heat the water. Okay. But but what we've done is basically, you know, obviously ripped it all out, <laughs> yeah. and and then reinsulated it. The floors, new slab, new floor in there. That's all insulated. Insulated the front walls, and then um, it took seven months to get planning for that. Yeah. Um, yeah. And and it's only a meter above the pitch. There. Yeah. Um, yeah, you can see what next door is. And uh, that's a wooden structure, and and then it's it's clad in in um, well, it's well insulated, and then yeah. clad in 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 eighteen mil ply, and then they they put the steel on top, and we stuck the you see the panels. You can yeah. see which one they 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 come like rolled up or flat. All oh, right. And, uh, and and they're like sort of plastic, and you, you they have adhesive on the back, so it's like you just stick them on. Really? Yeah. yeah. And then and then get a guy to connect it all up. Yeah. And so you know it's all connected and, and goes into the roof. And I'll show you that. You. Unbelievable. <laughs> that is not what I was expecting. Have you not, to see have you not seen a house like no. that? The, the, when we started doing it. Um, Turned into an eco house from an old Victorian house. Yeah, 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 exactly, house. exactly, exactly. <laughs> you got it. It was like we thought. Well, you know, when we started looking at renovating it, um, someone said, "Oh, well, you should, we should do it as ecologically, you know, sound as possible, as sustainably yeah. as possible." And then I kind of got googling and blah blah blah, 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 blah and like, and it just, it just yeah, kind of happened. Yeah, yeah. But the idea was, yeah, you know, there's there's like three million in the UK. There's three million Victorian terraces that are the biggest impediment to the UK hitting its climate change targets under the Paris Agreement oh. and the Climate Change Act yeah. because they leak and they, they're, they're inefficient yeah. energy-wise. And what I wanted to do was see if we could turn a, a Victorian terrace into a house that generated more energy over a year than it used. Yeah. And we might, we'd probably be quite close. Really? Yeah. Unbelievable. And, I, and I've, I've just um, like put a website up and, and the, the, the manufacturer of the PV uh, is a Chinese company mm. and they're like, oh wow, no one's ever done that with our stuff before. Because yeah. <laughs> normally it goes on industrial roofs is it, yeah. and, and you don't see it. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, I can't say I've ever seen it on a residential house. Yeah. And obviously all the decking out here is done, but this, yeah, these doors are all these windows, well, I don't know what you call them, doors, windows. <laughs> <laughs> they slide and, and, yeah, and, and, and tilt. Yeah, they're brilliant, aren't they? It's hugely up, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. yeah. It, it doesn't even feel like I'm in England. I never saw the garden before. No, I know, I know. I saw the garden. I know. I'm not sure you could see the garden. <laughs> yeah, but, kept, um, kept all, all the bamboo there. That's great bamboo. Like, trim these right back. 
the mirror you see those mirrors down the back there yeah. i don't know what i'm going to do with those but those those ones at the back they're all from the remember the mirrors that were in the house yeah 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 and um the wardrobe sort of I've, thing, I've, I've 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 to get so there's there's no white on them i've spray painted the the frames so they're dark so they kind of mingle and create yeah. a little mirror effect down the back that's all the wood that's a lot of the wood that was used in the construction for you know scaffolding and stuff like that to make oh, a yeah. fence under that blue tarp are the joists from the top of the house oh, okay and it's like 100 year old wood yeah it's amazing stuff when you when you plane it and sand it yeah. it looks amazing yeah. so that stuff there my mate sean who's uh, the architect who designed the interior and all of that and did the space you know did all that stuff for us he's also an artist and uh He's coming down, and he and I are going to turn that into a screen that divides the dining and living areas. Okay. Floor to ceiling screen. Oh, wow. So it'll be. Doo -doo -doo. It'll be here to there, and it'll be like really old. There'll be the joists from the roof basically yeah, yeah, yeah. brushed up and, 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 and done into a nice sort of. Yeah, yeah that'd be incredible. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, you've got such, you know, different ceiling length, you know, heights and all sorts, isn't it? It's, um... He's a good architect. Yeah, definitely. I mean, you know, he's, Sean, Sean's a, he's a professor of architecture at, at Westminster Uni and, and also at Yale Uni. And he's like one of the, he gets to write a lot of stuff and he's quite... Um, Progressive in the sense that he doesn't think like other architects. He had this art, this this, this practice called FAT, um, fashion architecture taste, and he's done things like, like Grace and Perry and things like that. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, like yeah, really, yeah. really kind of funky stuff. Yeah, I mean this is just nothing like you'd expect to see this age house. Yeah. I've seen so many of these houses. Yeah. And you know you can pretty much draw roughly what they're going to be yeah. before you even see them. Um, <laughs> I've seen a few different ones, you yeah. know, where maybe the kitchen diner has been opened up at the back or something. Yeah, yeah. But I've never seen a kitchen put in the front. Yeah, that was Sean's idea and again. I've never seen, you know, all of this space and together. It feels like it's level, whereas, you know, usually if you open a door, you more you've got like a small opening. Yeah. You've got to do the strengthening and all around it, and yeah. you don't actually get that open feel, really. It's like yeah. a gap rather than this is literally, especially with the doors, feels like it is completely open. Yeah. To the outside. Yeah, I didn't really have some of the that kitchen. It does make a huge big kitchen, you know, lovely big room. Lovely and we, big room. Yana insisted on these, so that, you know, when you've got the washing machine on in, in the yeah. evening, when well, you want to listen to different radio stations, you just do that. Yeah. It's a lovely bed, isn't it? Is this, did you have to change the windows then? Oh, we changed all the windows, yeah. 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 That's a huge bit of pain there, isn't it? Yeah, we had to take that usually out and get stuff in. Up. Yeah, Yeah. usually there's a split between them. So it's well, we like the old one, because there was a big one in there that was yeah. massive, and it, and, it, and it actually came out that way. Did it? Yeah, and, and the, all the window guys are going, oh, you can't get those anymore, you yeah. know? <laughs> <laughs> they won't let you do that. No. <laughs> so... Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's incredible. When you're in here, you still, it just feels like you could, you know, you're still outside sort of thing. Don't yeah. It's all so open. Yeah. But you can separate it off as well, which is good. Yeah. It's all, it's all rewired and things. And we're going to have like uh, Sean does this stuff with paint that's quite funky that makes it look 3D. Okay. So we're gonna we're gonna like he's gonna show us how to do a paint job that goes like over there, down there, around there, and back up the wall. Okay. Which will look quite funky, yeah, yeah. Um, and then we'll have that screen there. So it will look a bit different when it's when it's finished. Yeah, yeah. Um, that's great. That window because it that was his idea to do that, and it's 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 it really. Yeah, it definitely brings an extra light. Oh I mean, god, so yeah. So many times, if, let's say you do extend out the back, and that then makes the other rooms dark. But yeah. You don't get that here. You got that big bay letting letting all that light in through anyway, and then that has an extra. Extra bonus. Yeah. And there's a toilet. No, these are this is um, marine ply. Oh, some nice hidden treasure underneath that was lovely. It's, mar it's marine ply, right? See the, the lines go all the way in. It needs, needs cleaning and another coat of paint. 
So there's a toilet there. Okay. If, and if you like, he, he insisted that we match these up. Like, so. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the guys doing it were like, are you sure? <laughs> you know. So there's yeah. some storage under there. Yeah. yeah. Come on, then. let's go upstairs. Yeah, he's still need some storage. Go on then, show me around yeah. like you like you did. Let's have a look. <laughs> I'm the, not sure I said a lot when I showed you around. No. Nah. There wasn't an awful lot to say about the place. It's kind of one of those, like, let's see what they say and make their own mind up on <laughs> what they're going to do with it. These are the original floorboards. Oh, selling features about it before, to be uh, fair. <laughs> spare room. Yeah. No, it's not changed much. The room that's, yeah, got the solar panels on. Yeah. There's the, the heating is these infrared panels. Okay. They heat you and objects, not the air. All right. So they're really efficient. How does that work? Well, they're, 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 it's, like, it's like sunlight. Yeah. But it, you just feel it. Okay. You just feel warmer. Huh. Um, and they just flick on and off. Well, so you don't have to have all the rooms. So you, there's no radiators. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I know it's downstairs with no radiators. Yeah, that's the underfloor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's um, the shower room. That was horrible. Yeah. Was there a shower in before? Was it, just it was a, a shower room. Shower yeah. room. Yeah, yeah. The shower was there in this corner. Yeah. There's another idea of Sean's. He came up when it was all smashed out, and he said, "Oh, wouldn't it be great to put a bit of glass there? Couldn't get glass in here. No. But that's acrylic that we squeeze through the door. Okay." And that's right. the old lath and yeah, yeah. plaster. <laughs> yeah, you could spend hours in there, can't you? Looking at this. <laughs> so this is the original floor. These are original, yeah. These are original. We got all this needs painting. We, yeah, yeah. Um, but we had to put fire doors on because of this. So. Oh, yeah, this yeah. is Fred's room. Yeah. You, see, you see the... It looks cool, doesn't it? Yeah, definitely. When that first went on, um, there was it was like the autumn last... End of the autumn. Well, no, early mid-autumn. And like, first day it was on, the sun came up. And I was here early, and there was a, there was a dew on it. And as the sun came up, it started steaming. Really? Yeah. <laughs> nice. And it was like, wow, so I've, got, I've got a house that steams. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's Darth Vader's house, isn't it? It's uh, <laughs> crikey. Yeah, so they just literally stick on. You can, I can sort of see it. As you, as that's going to be a green roof. You can just now. buy kind of um, tiles with um, sedum on that, goes, that will go on that roof and make it a green roof. Yeah, yeah. Nice. Incredible. So yeah, two of these doors in there as well. All re and rewired and stuff. Is, uh, it's all completely rewired, yeah. completely replumbed. Yeah. Front bedroom. Yeah, it's got big windows as well, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, we like light. Oh yeah, definitely. Look, you can these are all fire out. doors. Yeah, this room was a, yeah, this is the one that's like had insulation all night, all through the walls. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I remember yeah. that. Yeah, it was a. I mean, I've still got that video. Have you? Yeah. yeah. So, so this video I can yeah. put next to it and go. Yeah. And it'd be great because you're in both. Yeah. <laughs> so if we had put on this was a bedroom. Too. Yeah. And the window had like all those staples round it where he'd um, oh, sealed yeah, it. Yeah. yeah, I remember that. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, this works so much better, though, doesn't it? Having a, you know, having a bathroom. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like this. Yeah. So you've got two now. Two baths, yeah. And a toilet downstairs, so. Yeah. Ideal. Had another toilet up there. Is there? Yeah. You're not going to get caught short in this house, then. No, well, you yeah. <laughs> two, know. Two boys. This makes so much more sense, on it. Yeah. I saw one down the road not, not that long ago. That right. had this as a small little bedroom. Yeah. Um, and they just, you know, they... They, they want us to change it about. They just said it's not really usable as that size. I think it was smaller than this to be Yeah. That no, was never going to be a bedroom, was it? No. Too small. Yeah, but nice perfect, for a bathroom. Yeah, perfect bathroom. Yeah, yeah. It makes a perfect size. I like the sink in there, yeah. That's one of the That's original good. doors. Yeah, Came yeah. one of them, and there's an original door down there. You just put the fire in it. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Let's have a look up here then. So this was... 
There this was that steep loft yeah. ladder up to the the, the horrible loft conversion. There was some sunlight coming through on the floor, but it wasn't quite through a window. It was more through the roof. <laughs> yeah. Crikey, so this is and that's another bedroom up here. Yeah. I didn't notice the little Juliet balcony when I was down there. I thought yeah. she'd been up there. See, this is another big double, isn't it? Yeah. No, this is a huge big window. Let's load the light in there. You can see the church Quite a nice little outlook out there, isn't it? It's good, isn't it? Over the rooftops. Yeah. Yeah, you don't feel like you're in the loft or an extension, you know, up into the loft, do you? Well, you said you you pointed out well on the video, yeah. like when we came out, you said, oh, you could you could put a Juliet balcony on yeah. up here because there was one down there. Yeah. yeah. I thought it was just going to be a dormer and a Juliet. Balcony, <laughs> that window is amazing out like there. The electric. This this well that one that's electric yeah 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 that it's opens good. up to ninety degrees so you can get Is on it? the roof. Oh, nice. I was up there this morning just cleaned the <laughs> the crap off it for you because there was some seagulls. We hadn't had any seagulls on it no. until yesterday, and they they took a shine to it. It just doesn't feel like you know you every night, well nearly every time I've got to go up into some sort of lost space. Yeah. The staircase obviously I struggle a bit with my yeah. height in the staircase and yeah. you know, I always hit a head or something, but don't feel like that at all, does it? It's no. So big and uh, such a tall. So obviously you've just squared off the back then, basically. It's from the ridge. Yeah. Yeah. You yeah. Squared the whole thing off. Yeah. Got us added so much more, hasn't it? Yeah. It just doesn't. That's feel a fire like window. Got that from China. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Cheaper to buy it in China and ship it than Is buy it, it here. No way. Yeah, yeah. But, yeah. Yeah. Here, and this is the den, what we call the den. Yeah, crikey, this is huge, isn't it? Shut that door. Off Shut and uh, uh, right completely and listen. You can hear the sounds changed. Yeah. It's it's, it's insulated, soundproofed. Crikey. Yeah. So you play the loud music. Yeah. <laughs> well, because yeah, because we were we were doing the roof, um, and they started doing their loft next door when we were starting when we were do, up here, yeah. and they put stud up, and you know we could see right through, and I thought, um, I don't want it. I don't ever because we've got young boys, you know, like going to be teenagers here. I, thought, I don't ever want to have them go and turn it down. Yeah. yeah. Or any problem with noise, yeah, yeah. so we use recycled brick from downstairs. There are bricks from down in the walls downstairs, yeah. as is the back wall, yeah. um, and and bricked it up here, and then put stud, and then there's like what's called resilient bars, which are aluminium bars that you nail to the stud, and then you nail, then you screw plasterboard to the resilient bars with the nails and the plasterboard don't touch the stud they're just on the bar okay. so it moves yeah so it absorbs sound then you put a layer of green glue which is a soundproofing material then another layer of plasterboard so that wall that wall the ceiling everything and the joists were all up and we've got rubber soundproofing on the joists yeah. and in the walls there's special soundproofing Crikey. So it, it sounds great. Music sounds great in here. Yeah, it? I bet, yeah. <laughs> and the projector as well, yeah. And we've got the projector, yeah. He's got a 100-inch telly now. Yeah, he's <laughs> got the footy right uh, there. Good luck complaining about that. I don't think I'd left here if I was watching the World Cup there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this Juliet back from me, it's ugly, isn't it? There you go. Is it right out? You can see top of Portland there Top now. of Portland. Mm. Well, you can see through the sea there. It's you can, like you can just there, see the sea yeah. through that gap, yeah. It's a hazy day, but... Yeah. No, you can see blue there sometimes. That's the steel, yeah. So yeah, you've stuck it in and then you just wire it in around the bottom. Those little boxes you can see are what are called power optimizers. Okay. And and they're a thing that um when you get shading from the sun, on a on a conventional old style sort of solar system. It was all just connected in one sort of uh, circuit. Yeah. And if and if one panel got shaded by a cloud, yeah, it would knock out a lot of the rest of it. Yeah. 
but those mean that each panel is operating separately oh, okay. so that shading doesn't affect it that much in terms of power generation. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's unbelievable. It's good, isn't it? Yeah, this really incredible. There's a storage under there. There's the battery. It's not Tesla, is it? Yeah. So like all day, the solar's filling that up. What well, it powers the house, and then when the house isn't doesn't need it, it yeah. fills that up. Okay. And then in the evening, the house runs off that. Yeah. Crikey, yeah. And this is mission control. <laughs> so <laughs> three hundred and fifty liter thermal store. This is the inverter where the the power. It's coming, you see there's like 1500 watts coming yeah. through at the moment, which is not that much because it's a bit hazy. Um, so when the battery's full and there's power coming through the inverter from the solar, yeah. this thing here will switch the power to the immersions okay. and heat the thermal store water. And this is mains pressure, water, hot water, because it goes, it doesn't, the water here doesn't go anywhere. Yeah. It just heats, it's, it's like a battery as well, yeah. so it stores heat and when you turn the tap on, the mains goes through a coil in there and heats. Okay. So you so have, you know, and, and, you, and, and it just stratifies, so you know, when, when on a hot day, like recently, at about 11am, the battery will be full. Yeah. And then this will heat up. Yeah. And only when this is completely hot will you start exporting to the grid. Okay. So it's that's kind of how it works. Up, basically, yeah. Yeah, and I and I couldn't help but put a a one gigabit hardwired network in the house <laughs> as well. <laughs> nice. So like when 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 the internet gets faster and faster, yeah, we'll be able to handle it. Yeah. yeah. And the Wi-Fi is like sort of industrial level hand <laughs> Wi-Fi, so <laughs> that, yeah. that can take one gig as well. Yeah. Yeah. Crikey. And there's one upstairs and one downstairs, and you just roam between them. All oh, right. Okay. Yeah, you can see the strut under there. That's what you did with the. That's what's all downstairs as well, is it? Hmm. That's what's all downstairs as well. That strut. That's the steel. That's what yeah. they look like. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, it's unbelievable. <laughs> it's nothing like I've seen before. To be fair. Huh? I've not. I've not seen anything like it before. Nothing is. You know. Yeah, so you got little USB points as well. That's good. <laughs> when we realised that um, <laughs> when we did this, that we didn't have a socket down there. Yeah. And like it was like, oh shit, where are we going to charge phones from? So yeah. I just put a socket there. Yeah. <laughs> and yeah, yeah, the yeah, I'm sure there's plenty of sockets in this house. Oh, <laughs> well, yeah, yeah, there are a few, yeah. Did you have somebody in to do most of it? Have you done a lot, done a lot of it yourself? Or? <coughs> no, we, you know, we have builders. Yeah. I project managed it. And so, like, basically, we had. I got my mate Sean, who I've known for 30 years, he's a really good architect, um, told him what we wanted. And, and it was like, we said we want to spend money on rearranging the spaces yeah. so that it's how we want to live. Yeah. Um, and you know, if we don't have much money left for finishes and things, that's okay because we're more interested in the space, yeah. And we want to recycle stuff and, and, and make it a bit higgledy piggledy, new and old. So, don't, don't go five star, yeah. Um, and just make it a bit quirky, you know. And, and then, so had a mate who's an architect, another mate who's a draftsman who drew it up and. Then I hired builders and, you know, my project managed it and found all the bits and bobs and stuff like that. Yeah. So there you go. Boom, I'll turn that off.